Hey Pisces, happy new moon to you. How are you all doing? For each one who is new to my channel, welcome. And for everyone who's been there with us for a long time, thank you so much for all your love and support. I love you a lot. And it's because of you that I have this channel and it's only for you. <laughs> well, before we get started with the reading, I have a new message for the new moon. I have been thinking of doing Twin Flame reading since a long, long time because Twin Flame and uh, spiritual work and energy work around Twin Flames is a part of my spiritual path and I've been working on it since a really long time and there has been this calling that I should start doing these readings so that others who believe in this journey, who are on this journey and uh, who believe that there is a twin flame for them or are struggling with that relationship also get the guidance because the energies have been very volatile, right? And everybody wants to know what's exactly happening and where is this journey going? Not that we have all the answers, but then, yes, when we do the readings, we do get the guidance. I've been wanting to do it, but something's holding me back. And I finally decided that when I get a thousand subscribers on this channel, I'll surely start doing it for each one of you out there. So yes, if you want me to do the readings, please do like. All the new subscribers, every time the subscribe count increases, it's going to motivate me to do these readings for you. So do not forget to subscribe. Let's together hit that thousand mark and then get started with the twin flame journey. I mean, the readings, the journey is still on and I'm sure you know it already. All right. Coming back to your reading. I think it's a wonderful, beautiful week for you because... What I can see here is that there is some event or a surge of energy which is intensifying in your space. It could mean that the new moon leaves you with a lot of emotions or realizations that come from within you, which definitely are going to help you integrate your divine masculine and the divine feminine energies within you first, right? I'm sure you all know that you already, each one of us has a divine masculine part and a divine feminine part. And it is only when we are in perfect integration of these two forces within us can we create, right? And it's wonderful that in your reading today, I have the integration of these two forces and it's also helping you get into your true creativity, which is going to help you in your professional life and also in your personal life. It therefore is going to make your journey very easy because if there was this whole energy of feeling frustrated, not knowing what's happening, while you may still not know where is it that you're going, how this energy is helping you is that it will just ease your flow. You will now be able to go with the flow and and it's it's going to be an easy ride if i can say so on the other side this reading is not like any other science reading because all that i see here is the soulmate connection if you already know who your soulmate is as in if the person is already there in your life then I definitely think that that relationship is going forward. If for any reason you were feeling stuck or you were not feeling that they have confessed their love towards you or they are not doing enough to take this relationship forward, lovelies, it's happening now. It's surely happening now because you have the lover's card, you also have the hierophant and you also have the queen of cups. This person now realizes that you are their soulmate this person now knows that you are the love of their life and no one can love them more than you. And this person is now ready to take this forward into something more tangible, something more socially acceptable, which definitely is a marriage in, I mean, because we're talking about relationships. Alternatively, if, if you've been the one who's been in a state of confusion or chaos, this is what you feel for them. You know that they are the one and now you're ready to take it forward. I think the energies are mutual, irrespective of who was uh, laid back and not in a state of realization. Now you're both on the same page and you're definitely going to take this forward. For those of you who are still waiting for the soulmate, I must tell you that all the time lag energies, everything that had to be cleared before you meet your soulmate is all done because now is the time. 
that you will meet the one who you're supposed to be with. So watch out for that. The energies are extremely beautiful. And I can only say that this new moon is definitely opening doors for uh, you to receive love, affection, companionship and blissful state of mind. So embrace these energies. Be in perfect union with your own divine feminine and divine masculine because so uh, you're just gonna be blessed <laughs> have fun take care of yourself and feel the love